Hi guys, welcome to my crazy life. It's Lori. Don't look at my hair. I am just getting back. Oh, I thought that was my hair. I'm just getting back from Canada this morning. Well, I got back last night. There will be a video recap of my endeavors in Canada. I needed coffee this morning like nobody's business. I went to bed last night at 8 o'clock. And was asleep by probably 8.30, if I had to guess. But I needed to go to Target. My boys don't have any treats. And that is a criminal offense in my house. And I needed trash bags because I'm cleaning the ratchet garage today. Or at least I'm going to do a big sweep of the garage and get rid of a bunch of stuff because it's a disaster out there and honestly this garage clean out has been on my to-do list I can't even tell you years and it's needed my attention I just keep opening the door and tossing things out there and shutting it so I'm going to try to get some of that cleaned up it won't be perfect today but I can get it tidied up and then right now we went to Target I needed treats and coffee coffee and coffee grounds and then oh, I'm all mess here I picked up some fun stuff two fun things in the Target dollar spot but I showed you in a little video because it was cute now I'm headed to Sam's Club I need some groceries for the week just some stuff for lunch and dinner I'm not gonna like do a big grocery shop I'm so sleepy I slept I woke up somebody's alarm is going off I woke up probably if I had to guess about eight, but I rolled back over. Okay, and by wake up, I mean Wellington was pawing at my face wanting me to get up. I said, sir, we are sleeping. And they ate dinner late, so they were fine. I just tucked him under my arm and scratched his head, and he went back to sleep. Um, I didn't get out of bed till nine. <laughs> I'm just tired. It was a long weekend, and it's a long drive. Um, I left the retreat at probably 11. And I got home oh, about 10, 30, 11. I left. I got home a little before 7. Now, I did stop at a Dollar Tree, which I'll have a couple hauls for Dollar Tree um, in Canada. And I stopped and went to the bathroom in Canada. Then I had to cross the border, and that took about a half an hour. And then, just because the line was long. And then um, I stopped to go to the bathroom and get gas uh, about a half an hour from my house, actually. But... I was looking for a bathroom for about an hour, couldn't find one. So when I go through Detroit to come home, there's a lot of like farmland that I go through. When I go through, uh, yeah, excuse me, when I go through Buffalo, it's more cities. I go from like Buffalo over towards Cleveland and down. It's the same distance, so it doesn't make a difference. My car needs a little bit of attention. I need to make some videos and then it's back to work tomorrow. Guys, I'm at Target and I'm dying. This is a scratch off national parks map from the United States. So all the national parks are on here and you scratch them off. I'm getting, let me find it, this one. And it's a map of all the states. Oh, can you see it? And look what happens when you scratch them off. That is so exciting. We also have some Fun summer stuff. I don't know what this is. Oh, butter dispenser. Stop it. For your barbecue, you put your butter in here. There must be a squeezy thingy in the middle. Oh, cute. And look at these for your kids. When you're out camping or at the picnics this summer, let's see what it says. It's a bug catching kit. How sweet is that? God, I love it. I'm off today, so I thought I would come to the Target. Oh, fun. I'm loving the um, outdoor stuff. A lot of this has already been shown by other vloggers, so I will not bore you, but I wanted to show you some cute things I hadn't seen. A trophy ice bucket. How fun is that? This must be for like your summer barbecues. Oh, if you're going to have some contests at your picnic. Finish line. 
Not my first rodeo. How cute. Oh, okay. If you have a little one, we need this in our life. One dollar. Okay, I'm getting that for my niece's bestie's little boy. It's one dollar. Sand or water toys. Okay, I'll leave you alone. I'll be ready for pickleball in 20 seconds here. Stop it. Do you think I need this to play pickleball in? <laughs> That's a no, but I would. I would totally wear it. I'm dying. That is adorable. Oh, I love it. Do I need a skirt? No, I have one. Oh, wait, let's look. Hold on. They have t-shirts. The Prince Pickleball Championship of 1965. That is adorable. And look at a pickleball belly bag. I love it. I need this. It's a Target shopping cart. Quit it. And it has food. Who doesn't need that in their life? Oh my gosh, I love it. This is what I'm working on today. My disaster of a garage. I don't expect perfection because, well, yeah, it's a garage. But we're going to get it tidied up. It doesn't look it because I haven't taken the trash out. But it is a hundred times better out here. Everything back here past the bike is trash. All those bags. There's a bunch of boxes over here. From the tote back over here is trash. There's some trash over here. Oh, over here. There's Alex. So, it definitely looks better. And after trash day, it will look much better. Yay. Okay, we're done. We're done making our vlog. I showed you my garage. I'm tired. Um, I just made a Shein video. You'll see that coming up here soon. I haven't even moved from this position. I know. And I'm looking at the floor here and I have bags of stuff to make a Dollar Tree haul and a Dollar Rama haul from Canada. I will show you one thing I got at Dollar Rama, which I think is pretty darn cool. It's a cat litter scooper. So the ones that you scoop tend to bend. So this is a scooper that kind of scoops it up and it's Everything comes out of it. There. Now I bet you're excited. Uh, uh, uh. All right, guys. I just wanted to close out the vlog for today. It's not real super long, but I've had a long work week and vacation. And I will talk with you later.